The Autumn Deluge is nearly upon us and starts with August delivering a number of great releases. Whether you're seeking the next big Switch exclusive, a new 4X strategy title, a third-person shooter from Remedy, or some good old-fashioned horror, this month is looking packed. Let's take a look at the 11 top games of August 2019. Madden NFL 20 the latest in the Madden series promises a bevy of new features for longtime fans. A new story mode called Face of the Franchise, QB1 is being introduced which sees player-created characters going from playing quarterback in college football to the NFL. The Pro Bowl will also be making a return, but gameplay-wise, perhaps the most intriguing new addition are the X-Factor abilities. Each player will have their own signature talents and abilities which can tip the scales, like having an increase on maximum pass distance. Madden NFL 20 releases on August 2nd for Xbox One, PS4, and PC. Age of Wonders Planetfall Triumph Studios is back at it again with another turn-based strategy title, except this time, Age of Wonders Planetfall takes the series' style of expansion and conquest into the sci-fi genre. The Star Union has collapsed, and six factions, each with their own units and traits, vie for supremacy. Battles are turn-based and employ some new mechanics like grazing where shots missed will still deal 50% damage. However, the developer is also looking to introduce more destructible environments, more complex economic and diplomatic choices, and more varied gameplay. Age of Wonders Planetfall is out on August 6th for Xbox One, PS4, and PC, so we'll see how well it fares. Metal Wolf Chaos XD Cult classic Metal Wolf Chaos is finally coming to the West… for some reason. The remaster, Metal Wolf Chaos XD, is being handled by General Arcade and will have an improved resolution, better graphics, and improvements to the gameplay. As for the story, it's about Michael Wilson, the President of the United States, jumping into an overpowered mech to stop a coup led by the Vice President, so what more can we say? If you're interested in third-person mech shooting with corny writing and lots of customization, Metal Wolf Chaos XD might be worth the wait. It's out on August 6th for Xbox One, PS4, and PC. Remnant from the Ashes Gunfire Games is known for the Darksiders series, but will be presenting something completely different with Remnant from the Ashes. This third-person shooter with co-op support sees players battling a powerful interdimensional evil. The key to defeating it is to travel to other dimensions, scavenge whatever resources are available, upgrading weapons, and so on while investigating the enemy's origin. Levels are dynamically generated with different encounters and events, and there are a number of bosses to battle on the way. Remnant from the Ashes is out on August 20th for Xbox One, PS4, and PC. Ancestors The Humankind Odyssey Ancestors is a survival game where players control an ape clan as it evolves through the ages. That means exploring new areas, hunting, bonding, controlling other clan members, and of course, evolving, with various skills unlocked in the process. Ancestors The Humankind Odyssey is out on August 27th for PC via the Epic Games Store. Control Step into the Oldest House, a surreal location that serves as the headquarters for the Central Bureau of Control. An entity called Hiss has overrun the facility and killed the acting director. As a result, Jessie Faden, a woman with supernatural powers, must take up the shape-shifting service weapon and fight back. As players explore the constantly shifting walls of the oldest house, they'll come across different side quests and NPCs, learn new abilities, and even unlock different secrets. Control arrives on August 27th for Xbox One, PS4, and PC. Life is Strange 2, Episode 4 Don't Nod Entertainment's epic saga of Sean and Danielle Diaz is slowly winding down with Life is Strange 2, Episode 4 releasing on August 22nd. The duo have come a long way since the horrific incident in Seattle and have met a range of challenges. While the final episode releases in December, Episode 4 might be a good time to hop in for the appropriate amount of tears and cliffhangers. Hunt Showdown Originally Hunt Horrors of the Gilded Age, Crytek restructured this title into Hunt Showdown, a co-op PvEVP game where bounty hunters embark into the Louisiana swamp to hunt monsters. The catch is that after snagging a monster's bounty, you become marked by other hunters in the area and must successfully escape to reap the benefits. 
With support for up to 10 players, solo queue, and new monsters since first entering early access, Hunt Showdown is shaping up to be a unique experience when it launches on August 27th for Xbox One and PC. Astral Chain Platinum Games is known for its combination of genres, but Astral Chain is on another level. Taking place in the future in the last bastion of humanity arc, the story sees the forces of Neuron using legions to battle evil. There's a bit of everything here. Investigations, exploration, side quests, NPC interactions, puzzle solving, and that's not even mentioning the combat. Players use a variety of legions in battle to quickly attack, bind foes, or execute powerful sync attacks. Astral Chain releases on August 30th for the Nintendo Switch, and we cannot wait to see what else it holds. Blair Witch Bloober Team's Blair Witch is a first-person horror title that takes place a few years after the first film, as former police officer Ellis and his trusty dog Bullet investigate the Black Hills Forest in Maryland. The developer's penchant for reality-warping environments and horrors in Layers of Fear and Observer could fit well with the Blair Witch mythos. Then again, this could be yet another horror title that fails to capture what made the first films great. We'll have to wait and see how when Blair Witch releases on August 30th for the PC and Xbox One. The Dark Pictures Anthology Man of Medan The other major horror offering is the Dark Pictures Anthology Man of Medan from Supermassive Games. It sees five tourists traveling to the South Pacific Ocean and encountering a ghost ship. Obviously, fun and happy times ensue. Much like the developer's previous horror game Until Dawn, players can partake in different quick-time events and ultimately decide who lives and who dies. There's even co-op and four-player support, making the journey for survival that much more perilous. Man of Medan is out on August 30th for Xbox One, PS4, and PC. And that about does it for this video. If you enjoyed what you watched and want to see more from Gaming Bolt, you can always hit that subscribe button and turn on the bell icon next to it. That way you will never miss any of our videos.